Alright, what's up guys? It's Illicit News here. And today I'm going to be teaching you how to get PDF files out of, or how to make JPG files or JPEG files and other files just like this into PDF files. So, um, you're going to want to go to this website. It's called pdflight.com and the link will be in the description and there will be this big orange button that says download now with free <coughs> now obviously you're gonna wanna click this and you're gonna it's gonna let you download here comes your little windows again just like in last video I'm obviously not gonna do it again cause I did it but it's just gonna pull you through a setup and you're just gonna finish the setup and um, you'll have it downloaded. <coughs> so, next, let me just check to make sure that this is uh, running correctly. Yeah, I think it is. <coughs> well, that seems to be working fine. But now, um, yeah, that's, that's YouTube. But this is the PDF website. And uh, here, I'm going to show you, I have, once you have, I'm sorry, once you have PDF Writer, also known as PDF Lite, once it is set up, you're going to want to make a new folder for all your PDF files, so I'm just going to make a new folder, I'm going to call it PDF. Obviously, I'm not going to put a lot of PDFs in it right now, but actually I do have my own folder, but it's called PDF Files, so it's somewhere deep in the bowels of my C drive. <coughs> but here's our document. Um, I want to create a PDF file. That's just, that's what we're going to put on um, PDF Lite to convert it. So what you're going to do this is for any Microsoft Office program that can output to a printer. So what you're going to want to do is go to file and go just like you were going to print. Except since I have a laptop and not a computer, I'm not going to have any com uh, I'm sorry, printer set up. So PDF Lite is the only thing that I'm the only printer icon that I'm going to get except for faxing and uh, XPS document writer. So um, if this is not the first thing that shows up on your printer list, this is the exact model for Windows 7, but it's very similar with XP and Vista. So um, if PDF Lite is not your exact, if it's not the first uh, virtual printer on your list, then just go ahead and click on it and then click you know obviously you wouldn't really want more than one copy but click print and um... it's gonna have you save it <clears throat> uh oh seem to be having an issue with my alright now I believe that we're I was having issues with my uh, computer, it was being very laggy but um, so when you open up Word it's gonna bring you back to your document and then it's gonna bring you to this and it's gonna ask you to save it I'm just going to save it in my file, P, should show up, maybe not, maybe I'll have to scroll down, oops, you can't save it into the exact folder, you have to save it into your documents if you want to be able to access the folder, <laughs> but you're going to save it as I want P, 
PDF, just as our example. Dot PDF. What row? What happened? Okay. Well, just PDF. No. Okay. It's not allowing us to save. I'm sorry, guys. I might have to restart this video. Right, so we print, and we print a copy to PDF Lite. Sorry, this is being so incredibly laggy. Um, I think it might be because my debut studio is running such a high frame per second that um, it's making my computer slow. So, yeah. Okay, so what this is saying is that from the C drive in the Windows System 32 configuration profile folder on the desktop, it is not available, so you cannot save any PDF files to your desktop. So, I'm going to go to libraries and we'll save. I want. PDF. Let's try it again. Save. I apparently cannot save here. This is just brutal, isn't it? Okay, well, basically, if I don't get it by the end, um, it'll save your PDF, and then if you want to upload it to the internet, you can use one of your, uh, your popular uploading, downloading sites, like Mega Upload or uh, Rapid Share or media fire and you can upload the file straight from where you saved it and your PDF will you know you could use it as a tutorial you can type a link to a YouTube video in it or you could do anything like that and um, yeah so let me just try this one more time there we go it's allowing me to do it it's just going to take a sec. <clears throat> oh, yep, see there. Windows has detected that your computer's performance is slow. That's because of my debut. So let me just change that. Options. No, never mind. Don't want to do that. I think that sound means that my PDF is done. So let's go into documents. And this document will let's refer to load up. This document will show up as come on. It'll show up as a PDF document. Sometimes it shows up as a uh, Adobe Acrobat, but now with this program. So I just open it up. Again, guys, I'm sorry this is taking so incredibly long. And here's your PDF. So thanks for watching comment, rate, subscribe, and I will post in the description before you all see this, um, to skip the last, uh, what was it, minute and a half, and just read the description so you don't have to suffer through my struggles on the computer. So, yeah, thanks, comment, rate, subscribe.